In this video, we will learn about the comparison of adverbs. This topic is covered in the Grammar for 3C on page 174. Last week, we learned about comparison of adjectives. We learned to say things like stultus, stultior, stultissimus, that is stupid, stupider, stupidest, or fortis, fortior, fortissimus, brave, braver, bravest, or pulcher, pulcrior, pulcherimus, beautiful, more beautiful, most beautiful, and faclus, facilior, facilimus, easy, easier, easiest, and magnus, maior, maximus, great, greater, greatest, or big, bigger, biggest. We also learned to turn adjectives into adverbs. For instance, we learned to take the adjective stultus and turn it to stulti, from foolish to foolishly, or stupid to stupidly. Or fortis, which means brave, to fortitur, which means bravely, an adverb. Or the adjective bonus into bene. Bonus means good, bene means well. But just as we can compare adjectives and say, brave, braver, bravest, we can also compare adverbs. And we can say things in English like bravely, more bravely, most bravely. Here we have an adverb and here we have its comparative degree and its superlative degree. In English we do the comparative degree of adverbs with more and the superlative with most. So, we could create a chart in English that looks something like this. You could have adjectives across like this, and adverbs across like this, and have the positive degree here, the comparative degree here, and the superlative degree here. And we could say for the adjectives, brave, braver, bravest. And for the adverbs, we could say bravely, more bravely, and most bravely. Well, the same can be done in Latin. You can say for the adjectives, fortis, fortior, fortissimus, and you can also compare adverbs in Latin. The only thing is that, we only, is that we only know how to do the passative adverb so far. We haven't learned how to do the comparative or superlative, and that's what we're going to be doing now. It's actually very simple. The comparative degree of an adverb, like fortiter, is the same as the neuter of the comparative adjective. <laughs> You probably recognize this word fortius as the neuter of fortior. The adjective is actually fortior fortius, and the word fortius can be used to describe a neuter object. Well, that same form fortius has another role. It also serves as the comparative adverb and means more bravely. We can also easily create a superlative adverb in Latin. We take the superlative adjective and we put the long e ending uh, of adverbs on it. You may remember this is exactly what we did with stultus. Stultus means stupid, stulte means stupidly. Well, fortissimus means bravest, and fortissimi means most bravely. So you make the superlative adverb by changing this US ending at the end of the superlative adjective into an adverbial ending, long e, just as we did with stultus, stulte. Here are some other examples. Here is keller, kelleris, kellere, the third declension, three termination adjective that means swift. So here's the adjective, keller, kellerior, kellerimus. This is swift, swifter, swiftest. And this is the adverb, swiftly, more swiftly, most swiftly. Note how kellerius is merely the neuter form of kellerior. And kellerime is the superlative adjective with the adverbial ending a. You can do the same with the word uh, with the word bonus. Bonus, melior, optimus means good, better, best. Bene means well, and melius is the adverb of bene, which in English is better. We use better in, in English for both an adjective and an adverb. And melius as an adverb in Latin is actually the neuter form of melior. And for optimus, which means best, um, the adverb is optime. We take the U.S. ending of the superlative and we change that to the adverbial ending A. And this translates into English as best because actually in English we use best for both an adjective and an adverb. So this would be in English translated into English well, better, best. This is good, better, 
best, and this is well better best. The end. This has been a Barking Blue Healer production.